It's had uh, some nice games. He's also had some struggles in the power turns. It's something that you, uh, position you've had some experience with. Anything you're trying to tell him right now as far as how to get through that and handle that? Nah, like during the game, I went up to him. Uh, I just told him, like, some of them they don't look right, just let it go. Uh, at the end of the day, the, the offense will get the ball going the, uh, going the right way, in the right direction. So if you don't trust it, uh, you got great hands. Uh, coaches will understand. KJ, you're, I think, four away. Uh, you, you might know the number better than I do. He is four away from the all time record. Um, does it get to the point where you're, like, really excited for this? Uh, yeah, um, because. You know, it's in the big games now, uh, so it'll be good to break that record with in the Big Ten or in uh, whatever we got after that. So, uh, yeah, part, I'm pretty excited. You love when we ask you about that, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> That's a good, better, better than some of the other lines of questioning you can be getting, right? <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Did you ever think that maybe this it might not happen this year just because of the you guys aren't throwing as many passes as you were last year? Yeah, at the beginning of the year, I was, you know, kind of thinking I wasn't going to get it because of uh, how, how we uh, the offices operate this year. Uh, but uh, I'm here now, and hopefully I should uh, get uh, the direction. KJ, one of the things about this team that, that Ryan Day has talked about is the unselfishness, the maturity. And I would guess that would apply in your situation. You probably were hoping, thinking, expecting to get a lot more catches this year. But all you guys have kind of had to be Okay, what's best for the team? Can you kind of describe what that process has been like for you this year? Um, it was kind of hard because um, I came back. Um, I had some high expectations. You know, what I did last year, then what I was going to do this year, being the only guy with uh, not having to share with uh, Paris Campbell. Right. Um, but you know, I just had to, I guess, set that aside. We 12 and 0. We're going to play for a Big Ten championship. Uh, we win that, we can play for it all. So I, I guess I have to put that aside and uh, do what's best for the team. How hard has that been to do? Uh, it's very hard. Uh, you know, it takes some time. You know, it takes some time to get used to it. There's a lot of frustrations. Um, but uh, we're here now. We're 12 and 0. Is it strange to have a rematch with Wisconsin? Because that's it's, it's an NFL thing, obviously, having a rematch with the team, but not really a college football thing. Is it, is it kind of strange having a rematch? Um, yeah, it's kind of strange, you know, playing the same team twice in uh, one year. It's, uh, it's my first time doing it, so uh, yeah, it's kind of strange. What can you, obviously they've got a lot to learn from the first game. What can you all learn from the first game? Um, we, know, we know what to expect from them. Uh, they're a great team. they got a great defense. Uh, so I know uh, we, can, we can play better, you know. Uh, a lot of us had drops out there. It was, Swimming ball, swimming pool out there. So, <laughs> um, but this time we inside, uh, we'll have no elements to worry about. Uh, I feel like we can execute better than we did in the previous game. What what makes their defense great? You've played a lot of good defenses here. Why is theirs unique? I feel like uh, they all buy into their system. You know, they um, they're trained well um, in their coverages. They got their uh, they run them very good and they execute them. Um, they rally to the ball. And I feel like they play, they're a tough team. They play with toughness on defense. So I feel like that's what they rely on, their toughness. And uh, you're going to have to bring it every snap. KJ, is this the, is this the most well-rounded, deepest uh, from a prolific standpoint, but also from the availability of plays standpoint, offense you've played in here, if you follow my, in other words? Uh, yeah, definitely, because we got different personnel. We got different packages. Um, different plays, we can run it from all kinds of ways. So, uh, you know, because they that really dial it up. Yeah, I was gonna say y'all y'all could almost attack Wisconsin in a totally different manner than you did the first time. I mean, if you wanted to, right? I mean, right. Um, so, yeah. Because obviously the passing game, y'all kind of were. Yeah. Because we, of the weather, but go ahead. Yeah, but um, I just say because they he a guru at it, you know, he can dial it up in any kind of way, and uh, he he like changes plays up, and then you see it ran from a different way and it works better so because uh, they uh, just like I said because they just dials it up so yeah. it's uh, a good thing we had that too thanks for watching subscribe below to get the latest videos from Letterman Row we got Letterman Live we've got the practice report we got rapid reaction hey and you know we got Buck IQ with Zach Bourne for sure we got recruiting breakdowns with Berm we got whatever you need Ohio State football and Ohio State athletics we've got you covered here at Letterman Row